Good morning and welcome back to KSNT News here on your Wednesday. It is my pleasure this morning to have Emporia State University's president, Allison Garrett, here in the studio. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you so much. Well, we appreciate you making the drive up here to Topeka oh, and no joining problem. us. No problem. No problem. Well, lots going on, I know, at ESC right now, no doubt about it. Well, to start off, though, of course, the legislative session just began. School right. funding, obviously, a top topic. Uh, how right. is that going to impact the University down in, in Emporia? Well, we don't know yet. Um, okay. That really is the short answer. We're all waiting with bated breath to see the governor's budget and uh, see how that budget might impact Emporia State. But we do have high hopes, so um, we um, appreciate so much the funding that we do get from the legislature, but cuts have affected all of our universities over the last several years, and we're hoping that some of that funding can be restored. Okay, and I know one thing that you all are excited about right now is the career outcome rates at we the university. We are, yes. For two years in a row, Emporia State has had a 98% career outcome or career placement rate, if you will. Okay. And uh, we have been absolutely thrilled by those numbers because they're extraordinarily high. And in many of our majors, we have 100% placement. How oh, incredible. Can you expand on some of the jobs that the students are getting? Oh, they're doing all sorts of jobs. And it really starts, Brittany, with the internships that our students have. Yes. More than 70% of our students are doing internships while they're in school. And uh, that is just phenomenal. And that gives them some real world experience. We have students who are doing all kinds of things. You know, the typical assortment of accountants, but also students who are interning with some great companies right here in the Topeka area, like Security Benefit or Blue Cross Blue Shield. Yeah, really getting that experience they all are. over Northeast Kansas. Yes. You're seeing some of the pictures of internship and career discussions there on your screen now. Uh, and that leads into the next question. You know, mm -hmm. what is Emporia State doing to stay competitive? Well, we have a wonderful career services office that is well supported by the faculty at Emporia State. Our career services office actually goes in during many of our classes and works directly with the students. And uh, we also have students who, on their own, will seek out services. In fact, more than 80% of our students are using the career services office. And uh, one of the things that is really exciting is a wonderful partnership that we have with the Dillards right here in Topeka. Oh, okay. Um, the career services office has a program that helps our students learn professional dress and professional skills. And uh, individuals from Dillard's help the students with understanding how to dress for the workplace. Oh, well, imp all important skills and those internships you oh, talked about, are. just key really to getting that next job. We know that very well here in our <laughs> TV industry. So. Absolutely. Well, again, thank you so much for being here this thank morning. You. Great to hear about all the wonderful things going on at Emporia State University. Well, thank you so much. Okay.